Welcome to Fit to Read. The comics I picked up on June 1st are The Walking Dead, issue 85, and Sonic the Hedgehog, issue 225. For the past several issues of The Walking Dead, they've been doing the No Way Out story arc, where the little community is surrounded by hundreds, possibly thousands of zombies. Those issues were not good issues to start reading at, but now it's like they've come to the point where it is a good point to start reading if you don't want to go all the way to the beginning, which you really should. Issue 85 is the aftermath of the No Way Out story arc. It's in this issue that you'll see relationships change and that people are done surviving and are ready to start living. From the looks of it, things are changing for the better. This issue is also definitely worth the $3 price tag. For if you flip the issue over, you get the issue zero of Witch Doctor, which I haven't read and doesn't look like to be my style, but this is a good starting point when I hop into The Walking Dead and also it gives you a starting issue of a new series. So this is a definite pickup. Note, there are two different covers for this issue. And from Archie Comics it is Sonic the Hedgehog issue 225. A lot happens in this issue so I'm not going to say anything about it except that it's a definite pickup. Very special issue because it has a gate cover where it folds out to be even bigger than the usual issue. And there's two different variations of the cover. Unlike The Walking Dead, this is not a good issue to start reading at, but it is definitely a good issue to have if you're a big Sonic fan. Next issue is going to be the Sonic Genesis story arc, which might just be a good issue to start at. I don't know from what I've told by the preview so far, but this issue is amazing with an amazing shocking ending. May lead or may not lead into the Sonic Genesis story.